Hello everyone, this is Enea here, and in today's tutorial I'll teach you how to create this Lauburu figure in Affinity Designer. Lauburu is a symbol originating from the Basque Country, a region between France and Spain. Lauburu means four heads in the Basque language and is representative of the four elements, water, earth, air and fire. Alright, so to get started we go to File New and we create a new document. We give it 2000 by 2000 pixels in dimensions. And then we click on Create. And then we go to View Guides and we add horizontal and vertical center guides to the composition. And then we make sure that Snapping, Snap to Guides and Snap to Object Bounding Boxes are enabled. And then we are going to start drawing the figure. We take the Ellipse tool. We set the Stroke to None. And then we set the fill to this red color, E50F0F. So we set it as a fill color. And then we go ahead and we draw a circle. And we give it 600 by 600 pixels in dimensions. And then with the Move tool, we center it vertically. And then we position its lower extremity on the horizontal axis. And then to create the first branch, we are going to need two more smaller circles. So we need them to be of two pixels less than half of the bigger circle. So that means we need a smaller circle to be of 298 pixels. So we press on Ctrl J to duplicate the circle. And we set the size to 298. And then with the Move tool, we position the smaller circle in a way that its top extremity matches the uh, top extremity of the bigger circle, like this. And then we unselect and we select it again. And then we press on Ctrl J to duplicate it again. And then we position the second circle in a way that its top extremity matches the lower extremity of the first circle. So we make sure that it is positioned correctly. And then the last step before we create the first branch is we select the larger circle and we need to remove the right half. So we go here to convert to pi and we set the total angle to 180 degrees. So this removes the right half of the bigger circle. So now we have all the elements that we need in order to create the first branch. So we press on Ctrl A to select all the elements. And then we go here to the Shape Builder tool. We set the action to plus and clean up all unused geometry. And then we go ahead and we create a comma shape like this. And then we take the move tool and we position the comma in such a way that its lower extremity is centered on the horizontal axis, like this. So the lower extremity must be centered on the horizontal axis. And then once we have it, we can start duplicating it. So we go here to enable transform origin and we set the rotation center in the middle of the composition. And then we press Enter to bring out the Move Duplicate panel. We check on Duplicate. We set the number of copies to 3. And we set the rotation angles to 90 degrees. And this creates all the other branches that we need to complete the figure. And then we click on OK. So that was it for this tutorial. You learned how to create the Laopuru figure in Affinity Designer. I hope you've enjoyed this tutorial. If you did, don't forget to like and subscribe for more Affinity Designer tutorials in the future. And until then, see you next time. Bye.